beautiful day. It feels like spring here in Portland today. It's absolutely spectacular. I had to get out of the house and take advantage of this. So today I am out on the East Bank Esplanade. We're gonna walk part of it and then cross the river and go downtown. The cherry blossoms are in bloom, or at least that's what I've heard. So we're gonna go check those out on the Tom McCall Waterfront Park area of downtown Portland. And then we'll wander around part of downtown and just see spring. Spring is in the air. I'm so excited. Let's go explore Portland. one of my fears heights over water we're gonna cross that bridge we did it we crossed the bridge it was a little terrifying in spots because there's like the max trains going above you and just the noise alone was terrifying Holy smokes. Now we are downtown Portland. This is Tom McCall Waterfront Park. Check out the view of the convention center. Right there. This area is the Japanese American Plaza and in the spring there's rows of cherry blossom trees and it's just amazing when they're in bloom. I thought for sure that there'd be a chance that they were, would be in bloom today because there's cherry blossoms, I can't even speak, <laughs> I'm out of breath. There's cherry blossoms in bloom throughout the city but apparently it's a little too early for here. Which is a big bummer because that's the whole reason I came down here. We're still going to wander a little bit down here on the waterfront and enjoy Portland because it's a gorgeous day and we're here so why not just imagine if these were in full bloom how beautiful this would be there's trees on both sides here so it almost makes like this bloom of arch and it goes on for quite a way it's so amazing uh, if I get a chance later in the month I'll come back can't promise because I don't know what's gonna happen I can't predict the future but I'll do my best I know like the shamrock run is coming up here soon for st. Patrick's Day and I do want to come downtown for that so maybe we'll sneak down here and take a peek and see if they're in bloom then
This is the area where they do the Saturday market. It's not open yet, but it will be really, really soon. It's that time of year. So we will be back and come check it out together. Very iconic stop for tourists visiting Portland. I personally am not a fan of their donuts. I prefer Blue Star Donuts, but you know, whatever. <laughs> All right, let's keep on going. Across the street is Dante's and the big famous Keep Portland Weird sign. Across the street is Stumptown Coffee. That is my favorite coffee in Portland. So awesome. We are gonna do a coffee vlog later. I have a pl uh, have plans for a series in August because August is National Coffee Month. So we're gonna go and visit different coffee locations around the Portland area and review them. And Stumptown is on the list. Found some cherry blossoms that are in bloom, so this is not a total fail of a trip downtown to see the cherry blossoms. They're so beautiful! We're about to show you the world's smallest park. Sadly, some butt munch chopped down the tree that was here. But Portland is strong, we will rebuild. Somebody replant something there. in the distance. I'll have to zoom in for you. Tom McCall Waterfront Park. I think I'm going to end the video because we're going to cross the Hawthorne Bridge to get back to our car. We're parked over by OMSI. It's just easier that way than dealing with driving and parking downtown. So, hope you enjoyed today's video. It was wonderful getting out, enjoying this beautiful day, getting a little exercise and whatnot. A little sad that we missed the cherry blossom, so we'll have to come back. But that gives me an excuse to come back. So I have all kinds of video ideas. Stay tuned for much, much more, many, many random life adventures. Click the notification bell so you know when I upload, which Monday and Friday, 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time is my schedule. Check my Instagram because I took a bunch of photos today and I'll see you in my next video. Have a great day. Bye guys.